selective breeding. Selective breeding can be seen in many places. A farm has two examples of selective breeding at work. Let's say a farmer was raising chickens to sell for meat. The farmer would like all of his chickens to be large in size. But not all the chickens on his farm were big. Some of the chickens were skinny and didn't have a lot of meat. The farmer needed to think of a way to get bigger chickens. He decided to pick a large male and a large female chicken and have them reproduce. The farmer hoped that the baby chickens would inherit the trait of large size from their parents. This farmer just performed selective breeding. He picked organisms with desired traits and had them reproduce. The wanted trait in this case was large size. Another example of selective breeding on the farm can be seen in the cornfields. A farmer is more successful if his fields produce a lot of ears of corn. But not all the corn plants on his farm produced many ears of corn. The farmer needed to think of a way to get his plants to produce more ears of corn. He decided to pick a plant that produced a lot of corn, crossbreed it with another plant that produced a lot of corn. The farmer hoped that the new corn plants would inherit the trait of producing many ears of corn. The farmer once again performed the process of selective breeding. He picked organisms with desired traits and had them reproduce. The wanted trait in this case was the ability to produce many ears of corn. The next time you're on a farm, look around and see the examples of selective breeding. Mm -hmm.